Hello and welcome to this quick tips video which is about speeding your fades workflow. So in the previous video we saw how you can apply a crossfade and edit it etc. Go and watch that video if you haven't seen that but sometimes you want to apply crossfades and also fade in and fade out. So in this section here we'd probably want a fade in at the beginning of this and a fade out at the end that then you can tweak to your heart's content. But applying those standard things can be a little long-winded because either you've got to put them in manually which can be a bit error prone or you need to go to audio fades and down here when you've got the files in question selected which is a bit of a pain so we're going to look at just automating that process with a macro so to add a macro we're going to go to edit and then key commands so we're going to add a macro i'm going to go through this pretty quickly if you want more on macros there's a video on the channel so i'm just going to run through this fairly briskly so i'm going to add a new macro i'm going to call it all the fades and then I'm going to add the commands that I want. So the first thing I want is crossfade. Now I know that the key for crossfade is X. So I'm going to hit X here and select that there. So now crossfade is selected. So I'm going to add that command. And then I want standard fade in and standard fade out, which are on screen, but you could search for them if they weren't. So I'm going to add standard fade in, standard fade out. And now I'm going to go to the macro section in the upper part. Here's my all the fades, and I'm going to add a key command, which in this case, I know that option command F is not taken because you can see it's not assigned to anything. I'm going to assign it there, and we're good to go. So now I can just highlight these, option command F, cross fade, and you can see the fade in at the end, a little fade in at the beginning, and we're good to go. Now you can just fine tune your cross fades, and you're done. As ever, hope you found this useful, and if you have, please like, subscribe, discuss, feed the algorithm, etc., and we'll see you again soon for more Music Tech Tuition.